Damien, stop writing in that notebook. This is my seat. Where are you? Uh, yes, Mrs. Flores. This is Damien's teacher, Miss Perez. I was wondering if you could stop by this afternoon for a parent-teacher conference concerning Damien's behavior lately. Okay, great. Thank you. Have a great day. <laughs> you want me to jump? Jasmine, who are you talking to? No one, Miss Perez. turning on all the lights because I like the lights but sweetie it's still daylight but he watches me who watches you nothing never mind let's just go eat dinner hi Mrs. Flores how are you hi um how long is this gonna take because I have somewhere to be um it shouldn't be long I just want to talk to you about what Damien's been doing in class but we can have a clean first So what, does he need a good whipping? Because if that's the case, I can do that and we'll end this right now. Um, no ma'am. It's just that earlier today, I told the students they could draw anything they wanted. And while most of the children do family pictures and smiley faces, Damien decided to write a short story. I told him to stop writing in that book. He's gonna get it tonight. All right, is that all you wanted to say? No, that's not it, Miss Flores, but have you ever read these stories? No, I don't have time for all that. Well, if you did, you would come to find out that he's extremely detailed in his writing. It's almost like he's there experiencing these things. Yeah, all kids write. What's the point? Well, besides the stories being well written, it's the story itself that worries me. What do you mean? Well, they're rather disturbing for a child. Like today he wrote about a boy who poisons his mom. Such a good boy. Can you put it on the table for me, please? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. What's wrong with you? Are you crazy? Why would you write those horrible things about your classmates? It's just a story. It's not just a story if it's so inappropriate that your teacher has to have a conference with me about it. But, well, Mom. Just go to your room till dinner's ready and stop writing those stupid stories. so much prettier like this. an imaginary friend. Victor is a man who Lucy. always wanted Lucy a daughter. isn't a good not soul just and has fun trying to hurt her. Oh, Lucy's gonna tell her to Next jump day, off have her run into a busy street. He watches the little girl from outside her window. Why are you writing these stories? And what's this story about a girl with a man watching her? I don't know, Mom. They're just ideas that go to my head.
one. Bob! Stay away from the street. Go get the ball. <gasps> Fine. 